The unconscionable truth about celebrity kid paparazzi photos on Thursday, the 60-year-old actor said as much in an open letter to Britain's Daily Mail and other media outlets, asking them not to publish photos of his children. Clooney argued that because his wife, human rights lawyer Amal Clooney, fights terrorist groups, publishing photos of their twins would put their children's lives in danger. Having to dodge adults' attempts to record them while on a public playground, at school or on a walk robs a kid of his or her childhood. It prevents them from enjoying the carefree moments that should be everyone's birthright. Every kid should have the chance to go through their awkward adolescent phase, miss an easy shot at basketball practice and experiment with faddish clothes without their every move being recorded for posterity. This constant surveillance also deprives them of the anonymity to explore the world and make new friends without people knowing the identities of their parents. A kid who makes a new buddy at soccer practice in between camera flashes can never know whether the person is genuine or merely wants access to a famous family. Being targeted by photographers also endangers a person's safety. Think of how Princess Diana died in a car crash as her driver fled paparazzi, or the tabloid photos of Britney Spears driving with her son unbuckled in her lap. Spears later said she was trying to dodge photographers, explaining, I instinctively took measures to get my baby and me out of harm's way, but the paparazzi continued to stalk us. No child should ever be endangered like this. In his letter, Clooney argued that he himself never publishes photos of his kids, but that's also irrelevant. Parents should have the right to share a holiday photo with fans without giving paparazzi permission to stalk their children on their way to school. Clooney specifically mentioned the Daily Mail because the tabloid had published photos of the one-year-old child of actor Billy Lord, later removing them. Moving forward, the Daily Mail and every other media outlet and website should adopt a strict policy against publishing photos of the children of people in the public eye, unless they have specifically been given permission to do so by the child's parents or the child's parents have chosen to bring them to an event knowing in advance that media will be in attendance. Photographers also have to be given incentive to stop this practice. Media outlets should refuse to hire photographers who take pictures of the kids of celebrities without permission. And when readers see such photos in the media, we should express our outrage. The ugly truth is that, if the public didn't create demand for these pictures, the practice would stop. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.